problem is this, that there's not enough ruthlessness. So, for example, I'll give you an example of that. Aidan O'Shea is a household name. He ought, to have been, he ought to have been taken off. At the very least, he ought to have been taken off early in the second half of the replay. In the drawing game, you know, there were problems again. Whereas with Tim Gavin, he'll say, it's not your day, son. Bernard broke well, his pulled bench, off. Joe, he's the, the bench, Like, no, you're waiting for Aidan O'Shea to do yeah, something special. Yeah, 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 I appreciate it. You, can wait. You, you may be waiting for a long time in big games, and what they need to have there mm. is ruthlessness. The management need to manage. And whenever you see photographs, for example, I mean, I just couldn't believe it, of, of Stephen Rochford at the All-Ireland semi-final with two of the O'Shea's. You say to yourself, what, do you imagine Jim Gavin going with two of his players, with Bernard Brogan, or, or imagine Eamon Fitzmaurice going... They need to be ruthless. Mm. They need to. They need to be clear-sighted because there are about 10, 12, 13 what? players in that team who what? are who are at the level now and who are totally absorbed in winning. And then there are some who are not there. They need, you know We're what they need? They need that sort of Pat Gilroy job. When he came into Dublin and turned everything around. Look at them over the next couple of months and see how they're. I think it's more up. than that, Michael. All right, you know.